Hey everyone, it's Shannon and welcome back to my channel. Now for today's video, we have got, of course, another haul. Now I actually couldn't help myself. I feel like I've done quite a few videos now on my channel which haven't really been a haul. So my mum did do my pretty little thing all of the other days. So if you haven't seen that, then definitely go check it out. But I decided to go on to Misguided and pick up a lot of stuff hey everyone i am just quickly jumping on to say that the day after i filmed this video I may have accidentally found myself back on the misguided website i know it's it's bad um but here we are again with another parcel now i went into their new in section and saw they had quite a few new in bits so i had to pick them up and this is actually all mainly loungewear and i'm gonna add this haul onto the end of the video so i know when i was editing it back i said like this is the last item it's obviously not the last item you have got a whole another haul here make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video if you want to see what i got in this parcel um but yeah now i've started to come misguided a bit more recently however i don't usually shop on there because i don't have like unlimited next day delivery like i do a pretty little thing in asos however they had unlimited next day delivery for 5.99 so here we are, I've now got unlimited next day delivery for Misguided, so you guys are definitely going to be seeing some more Misguided hauls. So yeah, I spent a lot of money and I'm really excited to show you guys some of these pieces. I picked up some really like different pieces, there's a couple of pieces in here that I'm like so excited to show you guys. Um, I'm actually really excited to see myself. I also picked up these lashes, hence why the parcel is open, however I've literally just opened it to grab the lashes out. So I haven't opened any of the stuff in here, I haven't really seen any of it. So if you like this video then please make sure to smash thumbs up button and subscribe down below to see more from me and yeah let's just get into the video so i'm kind of going to do a bit of a lucky dip situation and hope for the best okay so the first thing i've actually picked up is the one thing that i'm most excited about i can't believe i actually picked out of this at first um so this is a little bit different and not something that i've ever really worn before or something that i feel like a lot of people are going to either have a love and hate relationship with this i feel like i am too I've literally picked this up on a whim. I could honestly hate it and not think it's a vibe. However, I thought, do you know what? I'm going to go for it, see what it looks like. And yeah, so I picked up one of these little vests. Now, I saw Molly May put one on her Instagram in a blue one. Couldn't really find it anywhere. I think it was from Pretty Little Thing, but I don't think they have it anymore. And then I saw Misguided have this one and it is just like a utility style jacket. It's sleeveless. I thought this would be really cool with like a long sleeve top and any sort of bottoms really depending on what you want to wear of it i picked this up at an eight i wasn't really too sure what size to go for this i maybe could have got a 10 if i wanted to be a bit more oversized however i wasn't sure exactly what it was going to look like but yeah i'm really excited to style this and kind of see how it looks it is a denim material and it's just got some little pockets on it and like a little rose gold zip i didn't know it was a rose gold <laughs> Um, but it feels amazing quality. I think that's one thing that I've noticed with a lot more with Mascara stuff is that it's a bit more expensive, some of the stuff. However, the quality is definitely there. So next up, we have... Oh my God. Right. I spent ages trying to decide what colour I wanted this in and I am so happy. I picked up this corset top. Now, I've seen like everyone's kind of been wearing these recently and I've seen them almost guided in so many different colours. I spent ages trying to decide what colour I wanted to get. But I decided to go for the green because obviously everyone's been loving the green vibes at the moment. And I picked this up in a six. And can I say that this feels like amazing, amazing quality. Like I say, I always link things down below for you guys if I can. If they're not in stock, but I can still link them. Then obviously I will because I am that person that saves everything to my wish list and just keeps on checking. And usually most of the stuff comes back in stock. But yeah, it's got this gorgeous boning detail. And it is zipped up at the back and... I'm obsessed, like, so another great purchase. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I remember what this is. I had a moment then. I was like, what did I buy? Um, so next up, we have this top. Again, in a six. I'm pretty sure most things I got in a six, unless I wanted them to be a bit bigger. But so it is this top. Again, quality, amazing, on point. It is this cutout top. Now, I wasn't 100% on this colour, however, I feel like this would be a really, really lovely top to wear. Um, I love the cutout front. I think it's really, really flattering. Again, ribbed and in, just in this beautiful little dusty pink colour, which now I'm a golden goddess again. Um, I think this would look so lovely. Again, with some like white bottoms, black bottoms. You kind of wear it with everything. I love some staple tops that I can just dress up, dress down wear with everything because they're just so ideal to have recently been looking at my wardrobe a bit like you guys probably watch me think Shannon you do so many hauls but like I just 
I need some more tops in my life just to wear with bottoms because I now my bottom game is getting pretty strong and I need some tops to like jazz them up. So next up. Right. Oh, okay. I'm going to go for this. I wasn't actually going to pick this up. I picked up a bag. Um, I always seem to pick up bags in my hauls and I like them, but I just don't love them. And I really want a nice cute little, this is the cutest bag, right? I really, oh my God, this is absolutely adorable. How cute. I feel like these are such a nice staple to kind of wear with an outfit, especially for my Instagram, a cute little outfit pick with a lovely staple bag. This bag quality is amazing. And I am obsessed i love how it's like a v shape and it feels really really sturdy i'm gonna open it up actually opens up here at the front just how cute like i say i cannot fault the quality of this bag i'm so impressed only thing is is it doesn't have a long strap so i do have to carry it however the handles are a nice size and you can envision like cute oh no i picked a top up like this in my nasty girl haul which definitely good check out if you haven't um but the sleeves like didn't were ripped too big for me um but i saw miss guy did have one of these in in white and it's a little crop top you guys know i love my crop tops well you guys can probably tell because i've already picked up like three um and it is this white little ruched crop top now i've actually just realized that this is the same brand of the one that was in my nasty gal haul so i'm hoping and i picked the other one up in her extra small so i'm hoping that these sleeves will fit me however i just thought this was so lovely to wear with some joggers or wear with some shorts wear with anything basically you can't go wrong with a staple white top but because of the ruched detailing i thought it was a nice little added touch again so yeah it's just a pretty basic item however i feel like you can dress it up dress it down I actually can't, I only ordered this yesterday, yesterday or the day before and I can't actually remember everything I've ordered so bad. Right, oh my god. This is the thing I've been after for ages. I have been after this sort of style top for the longest time, misguided, pulled through with it. I got it in a six, perfect. Although I think they only had bodysuits in the petite or they might have had the bodysuit but it was completely sold out. Um, so I just, oh my god, I love it already. And it is just this wow it's a slinky material which i like however it is quite thin which i guess is good because sometimes slinky material can be a bit sweaty um and it is this little zip up oh my god i'm obsessed it is this zip up top with a kind of like an under boob corset detail vibe and it's just slinky i'm obsessed with the color of it i love the little zip i like how it's a bit more lightweight because like i say thick slinky is just a sweaty disaster um, and I think this was just like so cute. I just love the colour. The colour is everything to me. It's nice and stretchy. Um, might be see-through. Not sure. We'll have to see what the trial situation is saying. Um, but yeah, I just think this is a really nice top. And it, do you know what I mean? A little zip-up is great when you've got makeup on because I am that person that doesn't even... The fabric doesn't touch my face however i still get makeup like all around here and i'm like oh my god seriously um but i'm obsessed this is gonna be my new baby um you guys need to follow me on instagram if you don't because all these outfits hopefully if they fit will be featuring on my instagram of course you guys can kind of get a bit of an idea of how i would style these items a bit more this has been one of my favorite hauls yet honestly i'm loving everything what is this the bag was saying a different fabric than what it actually is, right? So I picked this up because when lockdown's over, I'm like, what am I going to wear when I go out? And I just wanted something nice to wear. However, I'm not the girl that's like a really dressy girl. Like I like dressing up, but not a crazy fan of it. And I saw this black, it's literally just a black satin, it's sort of got a bit of a cow neck, I think, um, dress. And I thought this with like my, I'm sure you guys have seen them everywhere, the pretty little thing belts with like loads of eyelets tied around the waist. I bought some Nike blazers and I know you're probably thinking, trainers really, Shannon? However, it's such a me vibe, like this belt, trainers. I was just feeling it with that cute little black bag. You see, love it. And I just don't really have that many nice dresses. Like um, I have got some floral dresses. However, I've recently discovered that flowers and pretty isn't really my vibe. I don't mind it. However, I'm a bit more of like a down and grungy sort of girl. Oh, that sound is so cringe. Not grungy, but you know what I mean. And I just feel like this. I love it. And again, quality, can't fault it. And you've got these little adjustable straps. So, you know, adjust them to how you want them. Oh, 
So the next item I got, I feel like everyone's seen this everywhere. And I was going to get the nude of this. However, it did sell out. And then when I actually thought about it, I love a nude jumper. However, it's not. I'm a black kind of girl. So like I say, you guys have seen this everywhere. However, I could only get this in a small. So I'm hoping that it fits all right, like a nice oversized length. However, if it doesn't, then I'm probably going to return it and then wait for another size to come in stock. I'm hoping that this is going to fit lovely. And of course, it is the Tiger King jumper. Um, I just love the jumper in general, not even because it's Tiger King. I just think it's a really, really cool jumper. And in black, of course, yeah, this is a bit of me. And I love it. I actually came to the realisation that I don't even have that many hoodies that I actually like wearing. Most of them are my boyfriends. Um, so I picked this one up yesterday from Pretty Little Thing in case any of you are wondering. I'm obsessed with this and now I've got another one to add to the collection and I just feel like black goes with everything. So yeah, this is the jumper and I love it. I love it. I was going to say this haul has basically been tops but I haven't really been finding any new bottoms I like. I really want some of those extreme rip jeans but they are sold out everywhere at the moment um so yeah and at the moment i've just been living in joggers so yeah i'm obsessed final item is this and again no clue oh yeah i feel like i wasn't actually gonna buy this and then i it was just ended up being on my basket and i looked at the total and i was like yeah i'll get it anyway um and it is this bodysuit and it is actually i think they said it's there recycled bodysuit do they do like a recycling thing um and it's this ribbed bodysuit fong bodysuit of course and it's black and it's just got a nice high neck on it now i feel like you're gonna say shannon you literally just bought a high neck bodysuit i know however um i just thought this was like quite flattering with like the little short tight sleeves um and i love myself a bodysuit if you guys follow me i literally live in bodysuits and i just thought this would be really nice to wear um, so yeah just like a nice little high neck Red bodysuit. I love high necks at the moment as well. They've been kind of one of my favourite things to wear. I honestly cannot tell you my excitement for the stuff in this parcel. I was excited for the previous parcel, but now we're here again and there is some gems in here. This is like the most colourful thing in the bag. So I feel like I feel like we'll go for this one first. And it is this. Now, obviously, tie-dye is the main thing at the moment. And I love misguided drop shoulder oversized t-shirts. I think they're such a vibe. So comfy. And when I saw this tie-dye one, I had to get one. They did have a pink and a purple one. Um, but I've been branching out from the pink a bit more recently. And I've kind of been loving more of the blues and the greens. Um, so when I saw this, I was like, I have to have it. Surprisingly, they still had it in stock as well. And it is just this drop shoulder t-shirt tie-dye blue and yellow i think this is so cool i love how it has it misguided on the front of it i love misguided's branding sometimes i'm not the biggest fan of clothing brands branding their clothes however misguided just pull through with it i feel like i've said this so many times in the video and i'm not gonna say it again but i probably will but quality on point and i picked this up in an eight because i know these are quite oversized anyway however i did just want to size up just one size about usually a six can sometimes be an eight but i just thought i'd get an eight in this and it's just so beautiful i love it okay so the next item i got is actually the main reason why we are here right now and i don't know if you guys can tell but they had just released some new track suits and these are ones with like a cropped jacket and joggers and they have black white and then two other colors i think it's blue and pink and i just thought I needed it in my life i probably really didn't but i don't actually own any white joggers so i thought i'm gonna go for it and the one thing that made me want to buy them is that the joggers actually had a thick waistband i know that sometimes when they do these sets the joggers have those really thin waistbands and um, but these actually have like a really nice a thick waistband they've got pockets as well which is ideal and they are cuffed at the bottom now i picked this up in a six and i'm hoping this is going to fit perfectly i'm just really excited and then the jacket is a cropped jacket but it has a drawstring kind of bottom where you can really ruch this in and that's what kind of really drew me to it never actually owned a tracksuit before this was 30 pounds however when i went back on there they actually upped the price of the white and the black one to 32 pounds so there's a bit of tea there next up i did actually pick this up to kind of go underneath the tracksuit as well i just think this is so cool again i'm obsessed now i don't actually own that much gray clothing believe it or not is this a crop top with like a little sort of corset detail again the misguided branding I thought this was so cool. Again, especially for loungewear as well. I just think this is so nice to wear. This is a bit of me as well. Like this top is just me down to a T. I love it. 
for the tracksuit as well i feel like it's a vibe it's up in a six and this does look sort of big so i'm glad i got this in a six next up we have this top which again i'm really excited about it's another sort of crop top oh my god i got so confused there for a moment anyway they had these in quite a few different colors however they were sold out the only color they really had was white and black i think and i didn't really want to get a black one but it is one of these like halter neck is it halter neck halter neck tops with this sort of elasticated band around the bottom now i really like this however it is a bit see-through so i feel like it's going to be nipple central especially when you can't really wear a bra of it i don't know if you guys can see you can kind of see my hand through it, it was quite inexpensive it's great however now i kind of wish i did get the black because obviously it wouldn't have been as see-through as the white but we shall see we never know however again i just thought this was really nice for lounging around the house in next up we have this top that i did actually want to get in my other haul however it was sold out um i think this is why i didn't get the black in the other top actually because i got this in a black and didn't want too much black going on I just think that it is such a basic piece however really flattering it's just this like a button front top with long sleeves now obviously i wouldn't have the buttons all the way done up i would do them down a bit and i feel like this with a tan again with the white joggers do you know what i mean i'm planning all these outfits around them white joggers i just feel that would be so lovely i feel like i say that every single time i did get in an eight because i'm guessing they didn't have a six so the final item i picked up is kind of loungewear kind of not it was really inexpensive i kind of got this on a whim however i do feel like this is going to be see-through which is going to be really annoying but it is just this dress it was only 11 pounds so i knew that this is probably going to be this really thin jersey material but i kind of just got it and gonna hope for the best um but i just saw it and i just thought it was really nice it was just this dress and now it's actually here it doesn't look as nice as it did on the model i'm gonna insert the picture of the model wearing it here so you guys can kind of get an insight to the sort of vibe i was actually going for um but it's this dress and it's kind of like an asymmetrical dress and i thought this was some big chunky boots or my blazers or any sort of trainers really would just be really nice on a summer's day um when you're just going out and about although it is a really comfy material so you can easily lounge around the house in it and also when it's a really hot day you know just a nice lightweight little dress to wear um so yeah you guys will probably see it on the try and clip what the situation is but yeah that is everything i picked up in my second haul i know i'm a shopaholic and it is so bad i can't believe I'm actually sitting here doing another haul but here we are um i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do then please make sure to smash thumbs up button and subscribe down below and i will see you all in my next video